All right, hey, this is the Delta Drive that we switched over. We used to have our Mitsubishi Drive there. We've now moved over to the Delta Drive, and if we're having problems with the Delta Drive, more than likely we're getting an OT1 alarm. If we are getting an OT1 alarm on this drive, uh, we can fix that. The easiest way is, as you see, we can use the mode button to scroll through the different menus. For example, frequency, hertz, with an H. That's supposed to be a V, so it's uh, that would be your voltage. A would be your amperage. It's going forward, and that's just a code we use internally. So, we'll, we'll leave it at the H. Press the enter button. This is how we go into our different parameters. We want it, we have to enter this password. So we're going to press enter again because we need to go to 0007. So there it is. 00 .07. All right, James Bond. That's our password. We're going to hit enter. It's going to say 0. Easiest thing to do is hold the up arrow until we get this very difficult password of 1234. Now hold it there. It goes really fast. If you go past it just like I did, bring it back down. No big deal. We're looking for one, two, three, four. We get it to one, two, three, four. We press enter. It says end. We have just entered our password. So now we want to go change parameter zero six zero six. So we're going to press mode. It says zero zero. We're going to zero six. Dot. Press enter again. Zero six. So we're at zero six zero six. Press enter. It is at two. We want to move that down to one. Press enter. That is it. We will literally cycle power, reset the unit. When the unit comes back on, it will not allow the unit to over torque. So your maximum hertz could be anywhere from 37 hertz to 59. It may go, it may cut out at 59, but your the blower will continue to run. This means you got to set your airflow to get 60 hertz at your uh, 60 hertz is what you want on 100% call on Intellispeak. All right, thank you very much.